Hello friends, welcome to Web Slideshows video tutorial series. In this video tutorial, I am going to create one new HTML document. So let's get started. I go to start, say here notepad. I click on the notepad. You can see that the notepad got open. Here I am going to write the basic HTML5 document structure code. We know that every HTML5 document begins with less than exclamation mark doc type HTML. By reading this line of code, browsers understand the given document is the HTML5 document. We know that every HTML document begins with opening HTML tag and ends with closing HTML tag. Within the opening HTML tag, we write lang equal to en. Lang equal to en indicates the language of this document is English. We also know that every HTML document is divided into two sections. One is a head section, another one is a body section. To indicate the head section, we are going to write opening head tag and closing head tag. This indicates the head section. To indicate the body section, we write opening body tag and closing body tag. This indicates the body section. Within the head section, we write meta char set equal to utf8. This line of code indicates the character set of this document is Unicode transformation format 8. I am going to save this file at the desktop by going to file save as. I save the file at desktop with the name slideshow.html. Both sides I put double quotations and click on the save button. I minimize it. You can see that the slideshow file is created. I right click on it, say open with the Google Chrome. You can see that slideshow.html file is open in the Chrome. Title is set to slideshow.html. We can change the title of the document by using the title tag and the title tag must be written in the head section. So here I write opening title tag and closing title tag. Within that I say web slide shows. I'm going to save this file, save, go to browser and refresh. You can see that the title is changed to web slide shows. For this video tutorial, this much is enough friends. I suggest you people to create one new HTML document with the name Slideshow. In the next video tutorial, we set up the Slideshow. For more benefits and be up to date, please subscribe to my YouTube channel and don't forget to like, comment and share these videos with others so that everyone will get benefited. Keep learning, keep coding, keep sharing. Thank you guys. Thank you very much. See you in the next tutorial.